On behalf of the athletic training staff, I'd like to wish you all a happy new year, and we all wish you a happy and healthy new year. Um, you realize the number one New Year's resolution every year is to lose weight, and I would like to recommend that you do not make that resolution. Um, and f you'd be better off making something that you have direct control over. For example, um, I'll eat three vegetables a day, um, I'll switch to whole grains, I'll walk five miles a week, I'll exercise 20 minutes a day, something that is under your direct control. Or you can go a whole nother route. Um, and say you're going to meditate for 10 minutes a day. Some other suggestions. I'm going to try something new in 2019. I'm going to try something new for the year. I'm going to try something new every week. I'm going to try sushi, yoga, a new machine in the fitness center, um, cross-country skiing. There's, there's all kinds of things, um, something you haven't done before. I also did want to mention drinking, um, going back to nutrition a little bit, drinking one glass of skim milk a day has been shown to reduce the risk of fracture by 62%. I'm not sure if it has to be skim milk, but that's what was used in the study. So that's pretty interesting too, especially if you runners out there. Um, or you can really get radical on your New Year's resolution and say something like, I'm going to reduce my time on social media to 15 minutes or to a half hour or whatever would be a, a reasonable reduction for you. And my staff and I were thinking that perhaps you're getting a little tired of us these days. So for the next upcoming year, we're going to be introducing you to some of our healthcare allies and partners on campus. Starting with next week, you get to meet uh, Jennifer Ballou. Bye bye.